So it's essentially a tale of two different kinds of weather across the nation today, middle of the week, the last day of March. Happy Wednesday, March 31st. Uh, meteorologist Joe Hansel, the western half of the nation is essentially quiet. A lot of high pressure out there today. Eastern half, though, one cold front, multiple weather concerns. So let's walk through it all. We had a high near 90 degrees in spots like Fort Myers and Naples, Florida yesterday. Record highs for you. You'll be right back up into that near record heat today. And a cold front is slamming right into an air mass packed full of moisture, developing instability and spin of winds with height. So easily a marginal to slight risk of severe weather stretching from New Orleans to Raleigh, Norfolk, Atlanta in between mainly damaging winds. Lining up ahead of the cold front will be the primary risk, but a few tornadoes and large hail is possible as well. A lot of the ground in this area is saturated, had a lot of heavy rain and flooding issues still ongoing at this time. But another one to four inches of rain is possible today with locally heavier amounts in the southern Ohio, Tennessee River Valley. So flash flood watches out there today and cities up in the northeast like New York City. One inch or more of rainfall is possible there. There are those flash flood watches in the southeast as well in the dark green shade through the day today. Also watching for some moderate heavy snow this evening through tonight, even into much of tomorrow. Five to ten inches of snow where there's a winter storm warning in areas of upstate New York, east of Lake Ontario. So there's that front putting it into motion today. Rain heavy at times, severe weather to the south. Snow kicks on later today.